Has the DCU, the new James Gunn DCU, found its poison ivy? Hey everyone, this is Digital Charcuterie. Thanks for stopping by. If you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button. And if you like this video, click the thumbs up. And if you don't like the video, well, they can't all be winners. <laughs> In an interview with Total Film actress uh, Karen Gillan, she had some fun. She's promoting Guardians of the Galaxy. Obviously, James Gunn was a great deal for her, brought her into this MCU universe. And now 10 years later, she's still playing Nebula. Who, and she's great as Nebula, by the way. Uh, and they asked, you know, about James Gunn, the DCU, as all these actors are going to, and as James Gunn will get be asked about these actors as well. And she said that the one character she would really play that she always found fascinating was Poison Ivy. Now, it doesn't sound like there are any plans for Poison Ivy, but I would venture a guess that James Gunn does plan to have more mystical, uh, flamboyant characters in his DCU, as opposed to what Matt Reeves is doing in the Batman stuff. So Poison Ivy could very well make her second big screen appearance in a DCU film. Probably not right away. Probably have to wait a little bit of a while. But James Gunn did say that he wants to work with Margot Robbie, Harley Quinn. He wants her back in the fold. And I think, you know, with Peacemaker being canon, you know, obviously the Suicide Squad would have to be as well and Waller and whatnot. It looks like Mar Margot Robbie's Harley Quinn has a place in the DCU. And what has she said? She said she really wants to explore the relationship between Poison Ivy and Harley Quinn. And again, that seems like something that could fit in. Now, he did squash rumors that a Harley Quinn prequel movie was in the in development or in the world which could be true which probably is true but why bother but if you if you boil it all down we haven't got the 10-year plan there's no plan as of now to expose us to that 10-year plan he said we'll hear about project as time goes on just once in a while we'll hear about a new movie or a new show whatever but this is a possibility that poison ivy could come in because you have an actress willing to play her she also says she'd play any alien in the background i should point that out as well she just wants to work with James Gunn again. But you have Margot Robbie, who is a fan of the Poison Ivy, Harley Quinn dynamic. And that is something that would clearly separate the Harley Quinn from the Joker 2 and from anything that's going to happen in the Batman, Matt Reeves' Batman stuff. So, you know, it's floated out there. Bautista obviously spoke to James Gunn about playing Bane, and that is not going to come to fruition. But this seems something that could be a little bit more tangible. Let me know in the comments below. Do you think we can see Karen Gillan play Poison Ivy? in the DCU. Would you like to see her just play anybody in the DCU? Thanks so much for watching everybody. Give us a like and a subscribe, but until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.